morning class. Today we're going to experiment with a frozen racquetball. You see now it is not in a frozen state and it is bouncing quite liberally. But what we're going to do is actually put it in some liquid nitrogen, which is way below freezing. Um, and we're going to freeze the racquetball and we'll see what happens when it's done freezing. All right, class, we're back a few minutes after freezing the racquetball. The racquetball should be at a temperature of about negative 200 Celsius or about negative 330 Fahrenheit. So that is cold. So that's why I'm ready to handle the incredibly cold racquetball. All right, guys, watch carefully as this as I drop this on the ground, just as I did before. Now we'll explore how temperature affects physical structures.